Hey everyone, you tuned into this video today because if you were moving to Staten Island, New York, you were curious to what are the six steps that I need to do in order to move. So if that's why you clicked onto this, stay tuned. Hey, first of all, thanks for coming and visiting my channel, Living in Staten Island, New York. I really appreciate you coming on, checking out these videos. Definitely love the support. And do me a favor, if you want to see more videos about living right here in Staten Island, New York, do me a favor, click on the subscribe button and hit that little bell so anytime a new video comes up, you get notified. So let's get into it. Hey everyone, my name is George Wanaka and I'm a local realtor here, right here in Staten Island, New York. And one of the reasons that I wanted to do this video today is because a lot of people always ask, what are the six steps that's important to buying a home right here in Staten Island, New York? Well, here are some of them. Step one in, in moving right here to Staten Island, New York is, well, it's the most obvious one. Reach out to me, send me a text, send me an email, um, call me. And then what'll happen is once we get to that level, we will set up a Zoom call, which is this new age video way of conferencing. So you can see me and quite frankly, I can see you and we can see who we're dealing with. And then we can have a more in-depth conversation about what your goals are, where would you like to live? Um, why are you looking at living right here in Staten Island, New York? So step number two, quite frankly, is narrowing down that criteria of our, what we talked about on our Zoom call to give you the most comprehensive search and maximize exactly what you go ahead and looking for. And that's the most important thing. So we're not wasting any time. So pretty much what does that entail? Well, basically asking you questions about the type of uh, life that you want to live. What's, what are your goals? Where do you, you know, what's your lifestyle like? So some of those things are going to be better positioned in certain areas than other areas. So those are some of the things that we want to find out what is important to you. So when we build that custom home search for you, it's maximized. And one of the things, quite frankly, that I found over 27 years is a lot of the times when people are looking for homes, they listen to sometimes their friends and their family that have lived here and their lifestyle choices aren't necessarily their lifestyle choices. So we try to balance everything of what you're looking for in order to help you find the whole home of your dreams. So number three, we then go out and build your custom home search. So what that does with all of that information that we've uh, that we've gotten together, the conversations that we've already had a conversation about, we take that information and we plug it into um, our computers and have that computer and those algorithms come up with some of the best properties that fit exactly what you're going ahead and looking for. So that brings us right into step number four. We're going to set up dates so you can see those desired properties that you've liked and that you want to go out there and take a look at. And that's part of when you get ready to come to Staten Island is setting up those appointments so we can maximize it in the best possible way. Going right into the number five, really number five should kind of be moved into the beginning, which is that's where I really put it, which is when we're on that Zoom conversation, we're going to have a conversation about lending right? How are you going to purchase this property? Are you going to be looking for a mortgage or do you, are you one of the few people out there that has all cash? Well, either way you want to do it, it's always important to know what we're looking at prior to going out and looking at a property. So even though this is the step number five, I always kind of put this right in the middle of that Zoom call of our first Zoom call that we're going to have just so we have a generalized idea because, hey, look, one of the things that I don't want to do is I don't want to go out and show you properties that you can't afford and vice versa. If I go out and show you a 500 or $700,000 house, but you can only afford $400,000, A, you're not going to be comfortable. B, you're not going to be able to buy it. I mean, let's be honest. And C, I just wasted your time as well as my time. And we don't want to do that, right? Because we want to maximize the amount of time that we have together to find you the perfect property. And now we get back to step number six. Step number six is essentially why we're here. I'm here to help guide you through the buying process from the very beginning when we take our first Zoom call till the very end when you're getting ready and you're getting those keys in your hands as well as getting ready to move in. I'm here for it all. I want to be able to help not only you, but your friends, your relatives. And that's where most of my business has come from over the last 27 years is the friends, the relatives, and the past customers 
that my clients have done. So going back into it, my, my job is to sit back and guide you through that buying process for when you put an offer in, for prior to going into contract and setting up those home inspections, to getting your mortgage, and finally at settlement or the closing. So I'm gonna guide you bit by bit by bit, and that is part of that process. So those are the six main tips in moving right here to Staten Island, New York. We're here day and night. We always answer the phone. I always get back to people within the same business day. It's one of those things that I just have to do because I love this business that I'm in. So if you're moving to Staten Island, New York, feel free, give me a call, send me an email down below, visit me on my social networkings. Um, I'm on Facebook, I'm on YouTube, obviously you're watching us here. I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, I'm all over the place. I'm the easiest guy in the world to try to find. So if you are thinking about moving to Staten Island, please feel free to give us a call. I will take that call, that email, however you want to communicate, and we will do what we can to help you find the best house for you. And if you haven't done it already, make sure you hit that subscribe button with that little bell next to it. So anytime we do a new video about living in Staten Island, New York, because we do a lot of them on different neighborhoods and a lot of other things on this channel, you'll get notified right away and go back and go look at some of those videos as well. And we definitely appreciate it. Until next time, We'll see you soon.